Hey everyone, Melissa here with Calgary Home Collective, Remax Mountain View. Happy Friday. Looks like the sun has come out now. Things are starting to melt. So everyone drive safe uh, this weekend and I hope you have a good weekend. I'm here to give you um, a little bit of a recap about how the first part of December is already heating up and how active things are and also a little um, recap about what we saw in November. Um, very exciting, very busy and active time in real estate, still continuing even as we get closer and um, closer to the Christmas holidays here. November saw about 2,110 um, sales for the entire month across all property types in the city of Calgary. So that number is staying very similar, very uh, across the board on what we've seen since August. Since August through now, we've seen sales range from about 2,100 to 2,200. So we've pretty much plateaued here in the fall, but sales are staying high and staying steady at that number, which is great news. Um, we do expect those numbers to come down a little bit in December just because of the holidays and New Year's Eve and all that kind of stuff. Um, sales are still, or in November, outnumbered the number of new listings that came on the market. So our sales to new listing ratio for November was over 100, 100%. I think it was at about 106. So amazing time to list your home. Um, inventory over the last four months is where we've seen some big changes. Um, August ended with just over 6,000 homes active on the market. And today I just checked and we are at about 3,500. So steadily coming down uh, the number of inventory. Uh, for a bit of perspective, December last year, December 2020, we ended the year with 3,672 listings. So we are already under that number. Um, and coming into the holidays, we ex do expect that number to con continue to go down. Are we gonna end up under 3,000? Quite possibly, there's a very good chance of that. Um, so we're really watching and it's gonna be very interesting to see where we start January 1, start the brand new year in terms of active listings on the market. Um, benchmark price for the entire city, all property types, um, ended November at 461,000. This is an increase over October, so it has even come up since October. And we're still sitting about nine, almost 10% higher than this time last year. Prices are still increasing, sales are staying steady, inventory's um, on its way downwards. Um, most forecast reports that we've seen have um, are predicting that prices are going to continue to steadily rise. Not sure how much, but they are going to con uh, continually rise into 2022. Um, another thing we want to point out, we've heard, um, it's been in the news that interest rates are going to go up in 2022. When exactly, we're not sure, but it is pretty much a guaranteed fact that they will. Um, so buying sooner than later is going to save you money. If you have been waiting, um, to see where the market goes, now is a great time to actually take action and get out there and start looking and buying. Speak to your mortgage professional. Get a mortgage rate locked in. You can get them locked in for 90 days, maybe even 120, I think. Um, get Take advantage of the interest rates while they are where they are because they are going to start to go, um, go up. Probably not right away in 2022, but as we get into it, for sure. Um... Another really amazing thing that's happening in Calgary is we are seeing people from other parts of Canada and even from the United States coming to our city and investing here. Errol and I both are working with, Errol has multiple buyers on the go from Toronto. Um, I have a client uh, buyer looking who lives in California. So people are starting to migrate and come back to Calgary, which is amazing news. Um, our pricing here hasn't hasn't gone insane like it has in other parts of Canada. We are still considered, even though our prices have come up, we're still considered to be a reasonable and a great place to invest in real estate. So we actually just tied up a conditional deal this afternoon with my buyer from California. So people are moving here, people are investing here. And again, another great time to list your home if you, if you have been considering it. 
Um, I mean, December typically isn't when most people would want to list their home, but right now, there really isn't a bad time to list your home. Multiple offers are still happening, specifically in that detached market. Condos are selling, they're selling. Um, every, across all property types, things are looking pretty great right now and we really, really hope that continues and we stay steady into 2022. Now, obviously Calgary's booming, we've had a great market. Uh, we have a great market on the go right now, but we're not the only one. Airdrie, Cochrane, Okotoks, High River, Strathmore, and even Canmore in November all saw sales to new listing ratios of over 100%. I think I saw Airdrie even almost had close to 150%. <laughs> supply, sorry, supply cannot keep up with demand. More homes are selling than what are coming on the market. So any questions about real estate in Calgary or the surrounding areas, we would love to talk about it. We would love to answer your questions and we would love to help if we can. Um, December is here, guys. We've had an insane first four, three days that we've had so far. And I'm expecting it to uh, continue right up until that week before Christmas. So, and even through the holidays um, and even New Year's. So if, again, if you have any questions, read out, reach out directly to Errol or myself um, and have an amazing holiday season. We get all your Christmas shopping done and uh, get to spend, have some downtime with family and friends, guys. Have a great day. Have a great weekend. Thanks so much.